Hello, this is Rant Kid coming at you with another fucking internet, another um, video, but this is not a tutorial on computers, this is about the Nintendo DS and how to hack the living shit out of it. Actually, no, just to download games for free, because who wants to pay 30 to 40 dollars for a fucking 40 megabyte size little cartridge that you stick in your hand house. No, no one wants to pay that kind of money. And fucking 90% of the DS games suck anyway. So I want mine for free. Fucking Nintendo piece of shit. So this is how you do it. First, you need to order your hardware, which there's quite a number of little things that you need to get, but nothing too overwhelming and nothing out of the ordinary. Maybe for your noobs, but I hope I'm not talking to a bunch of retards. So, you need a couple things from realhotstuff.com. Now, you can basically get this on a lot of stores around the net, but this is my favorite, the one that I recommend to all of you because they are fast, and if something was buggy, then you can just send it back. My friend had a older car that was fucked, and I just got mine. So he just sent his back, and I claimed it as mine, and he got, ended up getting a new one. So they're pretty fucking stupid, too. So you should really go with them. It's realhotstuff.com. Now you're going to go with the Supercard Mini SD, right under the Supercard under Categories. Supercard Mini SD, and you're going to click on that. And that'll bring you to a few packages that you can choose from. Um, some containing more materials than others. And for those of you who have absolutely nothing, you definitely need the um, mini SD. And the new Rumble comes with a Rumble feature, which is pretty fucking cool. I didn't get it when this came out. But you have that super card, that's what the SD stands for, super card mini SD, and you need the super key. And that, those are the two most important parts. But other than that, you will need a mini SD card, which you put into the mini SD super card, and that will contain all your games. You can transfer that from your DS from to the computer. So you obviously, with the mini SD, you need a, an SD reader, which is looks like an SD card, but contains absolutely no data. You have to insert the SD, mini SD card into it. So I suggest getting the $58 full package. You get the reader, the mini SD card that you put into it, your super key, and your mini SD. So that's everything you need to buy. Order it, get it the next day, and then the magic happens. The way you do this is you go to either Pirate Bay or IsoHunt, that's isohunt.com or thepiratebay.org and there's a few more but these are the two that I go to most and are the most reliable. You can get all your torrents and all your illegal shit here. So if you want to type NDS for Nintendo DS and then the name of the game that you want. So I want NDS the world ends with you. Type it in there, get the torrent, and look, I can either get it as a zip or a VAR. It doesn't really make a fucking difference. You can download that motherfucker. And download it again. And it will come. You have to get use uTorrent. Blah, blah, blah. You should already know how to use uTorrent. I'm not going to do a fucking tutorial on that. You go in, you open containing folder, unzip it, this is bubble though, and you grab the .nds file. That's all you want. All you want is the .nds file. And you can't just put that file onto your fucking card mini SD because that's not going to fucking work. Fucking stupid. The DS isn't going to read that. You need a program. And this program to convert your .nds, it converts it into two files. And 
converts your .nds, which is what you downloaded in the torrent, to two files, and that's a .nds.dsq. It's a much, much smaller file, and it it's converts it so the super key can read it, and it converts it also into a save file, so you can save your game. So you're going to need both of these files. You, you run the DSQ, and it automatically saves into the save file, and to convert, you use a program called Micro SD Pro version. Supercard Micro SD Pro. And to get that, you go into Google, type Supercard Micro SD Pro. I put board version 2.6. That's the latest. Go into your first link, and there you go. The newest version of Convert Software and Firmware. And you want to get the software called SC Supercard Micro SD Version 2.66. Download it, install it, and this is what you have a small little program. And before you do anything, you want all your files organized. You want each game to have its own folder with the .dsq and the .save files. And you want your outpath set to wherever you want. I have it in games. Go fucking figure. And you want, and these should already be checked. But just to make sure, you need, you need to have your saver patch enabled and whatever you want. So, you have your outpath. And now, simple. You add, go to add, and somewhere you want to find your original DS file. So I have a couple of my Ninja Gaiden DS. So I'm going to go ahead and do that. Click, you want to add your .ds NDS file that's not converted. See, it should add right here. And then you press out. Now this sends it to your out folder and it gives you those two files that you need. You go to that out folder, put it in that game folder that I told you to create because you want to be organized, you don't want to have a fucking cluttered piece of shit SD. And then you drag that, simply drag that over to your mini SD, take it out and shove it in that Nintendo DS and you have your free game. That is fucking awesome, isn't it? Thank you for listening.